That's all. Boca Raton, Jill, you're on the Savage Nation. Go ahead, please. Yes, excuse me, Mr. Dr. Savage. I have to let you know that I'm kind of offended because I'm a habitual marijuana smoker, and at the top of the hour, you were really bashing the <laughs> marijuana movement, and you were saying that we suffer from hallucinogenic um, side effects or something crazy like that, and I'm perfectly fine and normal. So I don't know why you tried to bring that up on the air and make us look like... Well, because marijuana or Mary Jane, uh, or a weed, or hash, or herb, or cannabis is an extremely dangerous drug. Whether you use it or not is irrelevant to the medical or, or scientific discussion. You do know that you are poisoning your body and that marijuana contains more than 400 harmful chemicals, including powerful cancer-causing chemicals. You do know that, don't you? Um, exactly. Same with the food that we eat from the grocery store. There's a lot of things in the things that we eat. That well, we not, wait, wait, you're not going to say that a carrot has the same uh, effects that marijuana does, are you? Now, nowadays it does. Look at all the farmers. And so nowadays. you're going to say that marijuana will elevate the heart rate and pulse rate? Mar uh -huh. uh, excuse me, you'll say that carrots produce panic attacks, anxiety, hallucinations, and paranoia the way marijuana does? I've never suffered that. All of my friends have never suffered that. So I'm trying to figure out where you got your source from and why you... Are well, I, it's not where I got my source from. The scientific literature is replete with uh, information on this subject. Marijuana is a toxic substance. As I said before, it contains more than 400 harmful chemicals. Shall I read you the list of chemicals which are uh, derived from marijuana smoke? No, but all I know is when we smoke all together, we don't care about the chemicals. We're happy, and that's all we want. That's all. Well, we that's want. right, and the person who sticks a needle with heroin in their arm doesn't care about the effects on themselves or on society. They feel good. So you're saying if, you, if it feels good, do it. Two totally different things. I do think what you should do is make yourself happy no matter what you have to do. I don't think... Make yourself happy no matter what you have to do. What about the effect that marijuana has on memory and memory loss um i i remember pretty much anything that people who don't smoke marijuana doesn't so i remember a lot of things and my memory is not but you may be you know you may be one of those who can tolerate marijuana and not have the negative side effects jill there are people who are uh, outside the norm uh, but the the norm is not you many many people are not aware of the dangers of marijuana it is not the uh benign drug that the libs want you to believe it is I agree with you on one thing. That is, you're right. Maybe it's not the right drug for everybody. But all I'm trying to say is I'm trying to defend... Will you marijuana. agree that, that marijuana uh, alters one's perceptions of time and distance? I would say not if you're a habitual user. Maybe it's like your first... Would you say marijuana affects reflexes and coordination? Would you want to be driving on marijuana? Do you think others should be able to drive on marijuana? I drive better while I'm on marijuana. That means you're a danger to society and you should be arrested the next time you drive on marijuana. How do you differ from a drunk? Driving that train. How cool. Savage. For all things.